and jump off when you are close. He's been part of five grace of TNT. No, 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 not now. Y'all got me in trouble. Okay, maybe now would have been good. <laughs> off I go. I made it over the wall. Security breached. Yes. Welcome back to another episode of Nessie Bang Bang. In the last episode, we did all kinds of stuff in Mexico. We got John seated and we were rescued by Abrahams. We killed the Santa. Finally! God, that guy was a jerk. And I keep thinking we're going after Allende and they just keep stringing John along with carrot after car just one more thing just one more thing just one more thing and I I'm starting to have some questions and the these side missions have been so effed up that I I kind of wonder am I ever going to catch up with Bill am I ever going to catch up with Escuela am I somehow going to get led into a trap and, and am I going to watch John die at the end I don't know I don't know, and I I don't know about Rockstar. Mm. So, I'm just going to keep pushing the story. And maybe, maybe today will be the day that we go after Allende. Because I, I think I'm like 42 hours into this game now, and I, I don't know how much more they can do, really. I mean, I guess a lot, and, and John just keeps... No. No, I done fallen for that before. No. No, leave me alone. Wah! And I think that I am almost over the flu. I still feel like I'm draining a little bit, but I was like low energy for a couple of weeks there, so thank y'all for sticking with me. That uh that last recording session was the first time I've really felt like myself in a few weeks, getting my energy back. Feels like everybody's getting sick right now, too. Of course, by the time you see this, it may have already passed because I'm trying to work ahead a little bit, but... Also, it seems that I somehow... I don't... I don't know when I took my poncho off, but apparently I took it off and I forgot to put it back on. And I missed my poncho. It's whatever. I ain't trying to help nobody or do any, do any more like crazy side missions and stuff. I I may just have to skip the Dedalius and Sun quest and maybe without my help, he won't fly into the canyon. I don't know. We'll find. We'll never know. I don't know. I might know. We'll know. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see what we get to. But right now, I just desperately want to know. If John's ever going to get his guy. All right. El Presido. That's promising. Are we doing it? Is this it? Are we doing the thing? Will he be there? Mm. We need to kill somebody. If it ain't Bill, it needs to be a Squela. And if it ain't a Squela, it needs to be Allende. Because all of them just suck. Uh, I uh, could have gone the rest of uh, my life. That ain't Luisa, is it? And I mean rougher, huh? <laughs> I'm so good. What's your most loyal follower, Luisa, say about that? Uh, who? Luisa, the girl from Campo Morada. Uh, wow. All right. A gentleman never tells, but she was a most wonderful. Uh, I just say she was incredible. Yes. Let me tell you something. I strongly recommend her. You take her when you have the chance, my brother. <laughs> she thinks she's your wife. Ew. My wife? These peasant girls, they believe every word a fellow says. Wow. So naive. Good really to know you're a man charming. of your word. I love peasants. No, you love What the fuck is happening them. right now? They I could have gone the rest of my life without voice. seeing his two centimeter defeater. Marry a peasant. My dear boy, don't be absurd. I'm going wow. to be the next president of Mexico. My wife will meet ambassadors, kings, other great men. Another. I would marry some peasant girl with a tight gun and the hands of a farmer. Well, I Ew. really don't think so. My mother, que Dios la cuide, would turn in her grave. Interesting. Another woman who's losing hard in this game. For you, my brother. I huh? guess the man you seek. Together, we will bring them to justice. Let's go. I didn't need any of that. I didn't need any of that. They could have just like. 
We could have just had the partially shut door and the noises and the woman come out and that and that would have been plenty. I, I get it. I'm an adult. I get what's happening. I don't I don't need all that. Let's ride, it's tacky. I'll do my American friend will drive this wagon at the front gate and jump off when you're close. He's been packed with five crates of TNT. That sounds crazy. How long's the fuse? <laughs> Probably not long enough. Yeah, oh shit, he just lit it. Times. It's plenty long enough, I think. I see you in there, amigo. Go on, John. You can do this. What the f is happening? Y'all gonna have to run, horses. Y'all got to run, or I'm gonna die. Who came up with this? I didn't agree to this. I guess I'm alive. Oh, them horses gonna get blown sky high. What am I shooting with? Give me my damn rifle. Oh! I think I died, y'all. I super died. Okay. I need to not wear the horses out before we get to the gate. No, no. Oh, shit. No, not now. Y'all got me in trouble. Okay, maybe now would have been good. <laughs> <laughs> no, I see that. Thank you. Yes, I see that I died. Thank you. Because last time the fucking horses just stopped. Man, they got some really specific timing. Off I go. I made it over the wall! Security breached! Yes! <laughs> this is fucking stupid. Okay. Okay. So go faster. Don't wait so long. How about now? <laughs> this is gonna be a great me getting blown up compilation. Now, do we do it? Wow! Yeah! Eat shit! Okay. Alright, who are we after? Let's see. Oh, he. Oh, come on now! Stick your stupid heads back up. Bam! Who we got over here? Who's over here shooting me in the butthole? Do I have to do it from the inside? It looks like he's outside. Ah, oh, shit, I done fucked up again. We gonna die, y'all. So hard. Okay, so I guess I'm supposed to run around figuring out who the check marks are. God, I hope I don't have to blow the gate again. So I was shit at that. Do I have to blow the gate? No. Okay. Oh, I am behind enemy lines. Let's see what I can do here. Right in your butthole. Who are you? Oh. Oh, how am I supposed to... Who am I looking for? In a door. Shot! Alright, who's up here? How many damn ladders are there? That's a... Ain't nothing here. What the fuck? I can. Shut up! Got people to kill. Cover these guys, dude. They're shooting me in the butthole. They're shooting me in everything, really. You don't. Hello, old friend. It is. I was like, he don't look much like a Javier. I guess he is. I heard you was coming. You took your time, no? Come on, you're not gonna shoot your own brother, are you? We was family. Am I gonna shoot my own brother? Then you and Dutch went crazy, and family didn't mean so much. So now you do the government's work. And what do you do? You just work for a different government. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Come on, brother. I think we should go our separate ways, huh? What you and Dutch did was wrong. And the way you left me was wrong. Now, I hate Coffee? to judge, but as it turns out, it's you or me. The way I see it. Might as well be you. We thought you was dead, brother. I promise. I'm telling the truth. I'm about tired of dudes trying to tell the truth Besides, to me because they never do. I can give you a bill. 
And those coaches in Colombia, I can take you straight to them. Hmm? You left me to die? Whoa. To save your own skin, and now <laughs> you expect me to care whoa, about whoa, you? You got it all wrong, brother. I've always loved you. I don't believe Even him. Now. And there it is. Should have just fing shot him, John. I don't think he understands everybody I done killed in this game. Oh shit, he's outside now. Mother Red! Where's my horse? Fuck I won't. Did you think I was gonna let you live after what you did? You won't kill me. Y'all don't even know. Y'all don't even know. But now you do. Now you do. Eat shit! Yeah! Come with me. The army sent reinforcements. Good, because I'm full of bloodlust. Use a, ca a cannon? A cannon? Like a cannon cannon? Okay. Oh man, I got to kill horses again. That was too early. That was not. Wow! Sorry, ponies. Sorry, pony. Mm, poor pony. I keep wanting to reload this thing. It's just totally unnecessary. Maybe I can hit just the wagon. Let's see. Nope! I cannot hit just the wagon. Sorry, ponies. Doop. They did a cutscene for this? Well, he's still dead, so I guess that's fine. Although, I hope John's right about them being awful and stuff. I'm just gonna choose to believe that he is. Two old friends reunited. Jesus Christ, can you thing. not? Can you not? You are another Mr. pig Morgan, in the wilderness. You down here. Oh, well, it is a pleasant it's the hats. I must say. He's not looking very healthy. We told you to keep them Did alive. Did they? You should be glad to have them at all. Just Remember your obligations Whoops. to the Mr. Marston. We need you to find Williamson, then head to Black. Did they tell me to keep him alive? I don't remember him telling me that. that uh, Dutch Vandalin is in the area. Your wife sends her regards. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck that means, but they gonna get it too. My damn rifle. I'll shoot them too. I don't give a fuck. Hmm. Oh no. Abraham got captured. Welcome to Mexico. My brothers and I are just discussing the future of our What the fuck is happening right now? Okay, let this man go. And who are you, Gringo? Okay, no, it no one. But unless you it is the army. tear you and your boys to shreds, I suggest you let him go. And you think you could tell me what to do, friend? <sighs> Here oh, we go. You should listen to him, friend. <laughs> Look at that. You want to risk it? <laughs> <laughs> the American is a drunk. If I were you, I would, I would pull that trigger. What the? An Americano. Yeah, yeah, matalo. What's a matalo? Oh, god damn it. Santa Maria. So you want to settle this now, friend? Or you want me to shoot you in the head right now for that poor girl? Okay, but poor Luisa. We fight like Are we gonna duel? Not like dogs. That's fine. You die like a dog either way. Don't make a damn difference to me, Raul. He's on my damn nerves too. Look, it ain't gonna let me do it. God damn it, Louisa. What were you thinking? What were you thinking? Girl, come on. 
fucking Come kitchen there knife. Will be more in their way. Fuck. Senor, there are prisoners in jail who will fight on our side. Can you save them? Two, three, four, five. I don't know, maybe six just for detention. There we go. Did some good. Whoa! Fuckers. All the time trying to kill me. I understand I instigated that. Ow! Woo! You too fat to hide behind that pole, honey. I don't know what to tell you. You too thick for all that. <laughs> With this number stuff. Don't tell me how to feel. Woo! Shoot locks. All right. Bam! I'm still reeling over Louisa. Like, I know she did something dumb. I do. I'm not negating that. And it looked like she didn't really have a future with Reyes anyway, but she could have found somebody. You got to go. Who else? Wow, lots of y'all. Oh my god, sir, move your ass. You got to go. You got to go. You got to f***ing go. That ain't gonna work for me at all, sir. Uh, you on the wrong side of that barricade. I should have ducked. Okay, so I need to do a little bit more caring about keeping my own blood in my body, in my character, instead of trying to get blood to leave everybody else. I don't know. It's tough for me because when we're doing stuff like this, Killing dudes is people, not men, but killing people is like eating candy, right? Like, it's constantly like, just, just one more, just one more. Next thing you know, you done ate a whole bag of chips. Shut up, fucking shooting them. Keep your men out of my way. Now, the real question is, do I have time to steal? Y'all know I'm greedy. Oh, there's still shooting going on. I guess I need to get up there. Maybe I could just, just Come maybe on, one more. Shut up! Go Stealing shit. Gun. Why do I need the Gatling gun to do that? Or I guess people are going to pour out and that's why they want me to go. It's whatever. Yep, here they come. Ooh, eat shit. Bullets in your face hole. Bam! Bam! Line them up, baby! I need them all. Come on. Ooh. Bam! The number is John Marston! Come on, princess. Bam! Eat shit! I'm gonna light your britches on fire. There. Right in your butthole! 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 Alright, that wasn't his butthole. You're not nice. Go on. You're gonna get in the butthole, too. Fucking hatchets. Hatchets? Axes? I don't know. Woo! Come on, pony. Give up, Williamson. Wait a minute. Williamson was with him? Oh, they've been stringing me on! Disable his stagecoach. I guess I'm supposed to take one of their horses. I don't want one of their horses. I want my damn horse. Ooh, we're gonna get them, pony! They're gonna eat all the shit. Eat shit. Eat shit. Eat all the shit. Bunch of school girls. Bam! They've been, they've been in. Ooh, they gonna get it. Yende been working with Bill this whole time. Oh no. No. How's that? Yeah, you will. T well, I guess that's fair. I did shoot his guy. Mexico is my 
Is that because... Is that because I shot the one? He was like, okay, let's shoot the other. I don't know. It's whatever. Well. My people are free. And it is all thanks to you, Joe. And to the people who laid down their lives. People like Louisa. Oh, yes. She, she was very brave. She nice really save. Missed. Nice save. Who was she again? I hate him. Your peasant girl wife to be? Oh, yes, of course. She, she would have a day named after her. Laura's day. Louisa. What? Oh, yes, I, I know Laura as well. Magnificent girl. Like riding a pompous bull in was amigo. You never saw anything like it. Ew. Anyway. What is wrong enough with Enough about you? sport. Let's get back to politics. I trust you will join us in riding on the Capitol. I'd love oh. to, but with Williamson dead, my jailers need me back in Blackwater. Hey, que hacen? Levantense. Well, I must say, I'll miss you, John Marston. I doubt you'll even remember me, Abraham, but it's been an experience. Good luck with the revolution. If you win power, remember why you wanted it. Mm. Well, travel safely, amigo. Bon. No more fancy words. All right. <clears throat> Is that... What's the G? I don't know. Y'all, we... I think we did it. I guess we're doing some cleanup. And I'm going to chatter at you along the way. This game, I think the most interesting part about it, because it's, it's not the control structure. That's... We're like 40-something hours in, and that's still messing with me. I think some of the most interesting things about this game are the archetypes and the people because they really they really have me chewing on stuff like <clears throat> the stories I mean some of it's kind of extra the side quests are definitely extra but by and large it's it's people it's things that could happen two people right like you have oops you have abraham who just wants to be a revolution leader and the whole time he's talking about how he's doing it for the people but when you look at how he treats individuals like louisa people is just a loose concept to him he has a he clearly has some kind of image in his mind of of what <clears throat> what people are and, and what they look like and but not as individuals it's just this nebulous concept to him right because he uses women and you don't really see him treat anybody else particularly special and then you, I mean, even the way he treats John, he, he uses him. And then you've got Allende, who <clears throat> was born into his power and is so privileged that he's another one who just, who is another one who just uses people, who talks about the people, the people, but treats people like shit hey, mister. you have Louisa who is you know like a, a star struck young woman believing all of Abraham's bullshit and I think we've all been there where we've believed in someone or something way more than they actually believed in us and it ends in her death. Even the, even the shopkeeper, the dude who sold snake oil, right? Like he was so focused on having money, he didn't care what he did and how he got it. And you've got Seth, who was so focused on getting the treasure that he 
was out there doing weird stuff with bodies. And I mean, I guess it's, there was definitely some mama trauma there, it sounded like. But even John, right? John's this bad turned good guy who just wants to get back to his his normal life, but is doing all this bad shit to catch bad guys so he can go back home and be a good guy. And just about every character in this game has you wondering, has you looking at, like, does the end justify the means? Like, even when we were helping... I have, I think my brain has deliberately blocked out his name because I hated him. West Dickens, Nigel West Dickens. Like, even when you, even when you look at him, right? Like we, he's out there lying and taking people's money because he just mostly seems to care about money. And in pursuit of that, in pursuit of John trying to get to his guys, we're helping this awful guy just so we can use his truck to the point that we have a mob come after us. We know that Wes Dickens is a liar. We know he's a cheat. We could have just killed Wes Dickens and taken his truck but instead, we ended up shooting a whole town's worth of people or two towns worth of people just to keep him alive. Did the end justify the means? It would have been a lot quicker and simpler. And honestly, it might have done a lot of people some good and prevented them from being swindled out of their money if we had just killed Wes Dickens and taken his truck. Just saying. Same thing with Allende. We're helping Allende. We're helping um, DeSanta do all this crazy stuff to try and get their help when it turns out they're in league with, with Bill the whole damn time, apparently. Or Bill came to them and they didn't... They sure weren't calling us. Of course, we were at odds, I guess, a little bit by then. But I don't know. It's just... Did... Everything John did just was it was it justified by him getting what he wanted and presumably presumably I don't know if we'll find out being able to go back to his family does that justify it I don't I don't know it's just a really interesting look at people and their obsessions and how far they'll go to get what they want or keep what they have. All right, I'm done. Let's kill some shit. The landscapes are so pretty in this game. This is weird. Does he have a crush on me? Are you stalking me? Hey, there's a beautiful spot. Sure. <sighs> what are you doing here? My accounts. I'm an accountant. Is that so? In a way. What's your name? You know, it's the darndest thing. I can't remember. Tell me your damn name and where you know me from. Well, I know you're from Mexico. I know you're from back out west. Well, I know you from all over. Tell me your name or I won't be responsible for my actions. Oh, but you will. You will be responsible. This is a fine spot. See you around, cowboy. What the hell? I need to know! Damn you! Yes, many have. What the fuck? What the fuck? That was weird as shit. Come on, Black Betty. That is your name from now on. Let's do it. God dang, who is the stranger? Someone John killed? Someone he wronged? A figment of my imagination? Ghost to Christmas past? Like... Blackwater. Oh, this is Blackwater. All right. Oh, ain't this a right proper little town? 
That ain't that serious. Yeah. Oh. Where'd you go? Where'd you pick up these papers? <laughs> Can I buy a paper or not? Fuck it then. I don't want your stink ass paper. I'm just gonna. How you doing? Yeah. Fuck your paper then. Why are you shooting at me? Run, dog. Mr. Marston, so glad to see you. How was your journey? Where's my wife and son? <gasps> Being well looked after. Oh. Well looked after. Is Once this where we live? Mr. Ross wants to speak. Is that why I have that We've apartment? Some important developments. You want me to take out a gun and blow a fucking hole in your head right here? <clears throat> right now? You want that? Mr. Marston. You want that? Mr. Marston, I ask you to calm down. Why? Why? I did what you asked. I got you Williamson and Esquela. It's over. Stop That's playing who these games are. with me. No one's playing games with you, Mr. Marston. Everybody's playing games with me. Play some games. There'd be some interesting ones we could play. Yes, sir. Like hanging you for murder. Or confiscating all your property. Like that little farm of yours. Or, or having you put in an electric chair. Those are the sort of games we could play. But we choose to play a different game. So calm down. And play along with us. Where's my wife? <laughs> you know, I forget, but I hear it's very nice this time of year. <sighs> Mr. Marston, please. I've never insulted your meager intelligence. Oof. Do not insult mine. You, We've done you this just did. Deal for your freedom in exchange for all your men from your old gang. You gave us Williamson and Escuela. We still don't have Vanderlyn, but now we know where he is. Then go and shoot him. No, sir. I want you to shoot him for me. And then I'll let you be. The last thing I want to do is make martyrs out of all these people. He could be killed by some petty squab or by another lowlife. We believe Vanderlyn just you holed rude. up with a group of renegades near the wreck of the Serendipity Riverboat. Ah, <sighs> yes. Dutch. Another group of renegades. Obviously, the first group, your group, has... Shall we say been disbanded? <laughs> Dis <laughs> anyway, Mr. Fordham, Mr. Fuckers. Shall we go? Oh, Mr. Marston, your wife and son are. I'm. Oh, I'm well. over. I'm. Keep my wife's name out your mouth. I know he didn't say her name. I don't care. Do Stop talking about my wife. My kid. Oh, Mr. Marston, one more thing. This is for you. You're too kind. See, I have nothing but your best interest at heart. You're a dick. Let's hope it doesn't go off by mistake. Mm. 343? I, I have a patent for that, sir. This is an outrage. You uh, Mr. Marston. fucker. You're alive. Hello, Speak Dickens. of the damn so devil and lo, here he comes. So did I. So did I. In a long story. But now it seems I'm being put under arrest and charged with narcotic possession or some other such nonsense. Tracks. Ross, have him release this. Oh, John! Because he's a harmless old fraud, the kind of man that built this country. And because he helped me get Williamson. Did you hear that, officer? The man's a hero. Let him go. Come on, Marston. Moral degeneracy waits for no man. Let's hurry along. John. We were just talking about this. It's not far now. Okay. The serendipity wreck has been used as an occasional criminal hideout for years. They gave me a new gun. High power pistol. Oh, girl, talk dirty to me. We were informed that Vanderlyn and his gang are making camp there. We'll stop on the cliff above, and you and Agent Fordham will go on foot. I'll stay with the vehicle. And My damn wife and kid better and be you'll okay. You'll do as I say, Marston. Don't try anything stupid. Oh, I. Knows what's at stake. Don't you miss Can I Marston? kill both of them after this? Dutch and finish this? Can I? You leave Dutch to me. We don't want you getting that suit dirty. If you step out of line, even once, well, I hope you're aware of the consequences. Y'all have made that perfectly fucking clear, you bunch of assholes. Did you hear that? Go see what's happening up there. I'll wait here. Go see what's happening. 
Well, the creep factor is super high. Oh, just some dude up here screaming. Over here! I found him! Good God, that's her informant! Gnostics, what the hell's going on here? It's a trap! Shit, Marston! No shit! Carry this man. I don't think he can walk! Bastard! Come on, we need to get him to safety! Wait, are those good guys? They are not good guys. With you, you can't be doing that. Shut up, shit dick! Mm, carrying your fucking informant. I got some little to go. I'm a boot you too. Hey, stupid, how about you not run in front of me? Sweet pea. Come on, princess. Everybody's dead. I done got them, you asshole. God, I can't even steal with this guy. Alright, so maybe there's a couple more. I'll just climb this hill, it's fine. Don't help! Yeah, you you go on up ahead. Alright. I totally got this. Put him in the car so we can get out of here. Let's go, there might be more of them. Okay. We gonna be shooting on the road. Oh, I can't there. switch guns. Trap. They were waiting for us. And who is this savage? A prisoner? What the f***ing informant, sir? Do you speak Jesus English? Jesus Christ. Uh, uh, yes he does, sir. He's the informant. Nasta. Don't get snarky with me, Fordham. We found him tied well, up the boat. Well, don't be a dumbass. Nice of you to help us out. Hell of a plan sending in two men to take on an entire gang of outlaws. Especially when one of them's an office clerk. Or social secretary or some such. You shut your mouth! <laughs> well, this is fascinating. We're about to get jumped. What is happening? Why is this so long? Come on, not now. And there it What's is. Wrong? I don't know. The motor just gave out. Well, fix it, you fool. We need to get this Yeah, he, to he super looks like sir. a mechanic. It's Dutch's men. Of Boston, course it is. We'll hold them off. Hold them, we'll fix that damn engine. Oh shit. Thank you. No, I need to steal. This is the office of an anthropologist named McDougal. He was thrown out of Yale for a degeneracy. Ooh, he dokey. Tell you something. Indeed. But he's been helping us deal with the natives in this area. They see him and they presume we're all idiot academics. Huh? Give me a hand here, Marston. Ah, Mr. Ross. Uh, Mr. Fordham? G good day. G good day. What on earth's going on here? Kid got shot in the leg. Beat up pretty good. We'll send a doctor. Are his now. cheeks scarred? Mm -hmm. Like the Joker? We need information from this fellow. About or is he just Vandal. dirty? Can you see what you can find out for us? I do my best, sir. Make sure you do. Okay, Professor okay. McDougal has been a good friend of the U.S. government, Mr. Marston. Just like you. Why don't you see if you can help him in his study of the native problem in this county? That's a good thing. Problems. Hmph. What? Now. What a pleasant surprise, Mr. Marston. Mm-hmm. The informer just told us some interesting news. Our mutual friend, Mr. Vanderlyn, is about to pay call on his bank manager. What do you say to have a little financial <clears throat> discussion with the fellow? This way. It better not be the ghost. Let's get up on the roof. Who is we'll death? God. There. The I know you quest guy who like wasn't phased by bullets, said he was an accountant of sorts, and said I'd pay for my crimes and stuff, and questioning my morality and setting up these weird tests and stuff. Better not be him, cause he ain't phased by bullets. Got him. Got him. Bam! Get the man at the window. Bam. Yeah. Right in your butthole. Right in your head. Marston, head into the bank with Hopkins and Manny. Mm-hmm. Dutch. Be Get careful. Dutch. There may be some innocent yeah. people. Mm -hmm. God, I wanna kill these guys so hard. 
Run, 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 run. What is that light flashing up there? Am I about to get my dick shot off? Ow, oh, who shot me? Shoot him back. Ow, lots of people shooting me. Could y'all do some fucking cover fire or something? Make your damn stupid dick ass self useful? That's what you get. Should have been helping me shoot him. Ow, Jesus Christ, shot. Shot. Boop, boop. And we're gonna boop him. Shoot him! Ooh, I need to get downstairs a little. Eat shit. 